Hi, we're here with Tyson Kwiatkowski. Uh, Ty, obviously a very tough match for you against a very informed James Duckworth. Um, can you talk about what you thought you did you know, well in the match and then maybe not as well as you, you'd like? Yeah, um, well, I think I had a slow start. And um, at this level, if you um, give an opponent of this caliber uh, some free points in the beginning, it's going gonna, it's gonna to be very tough later on. Um, I served pretty well, but um, honestly, on the return, the guy served lights out. and. Uh, I had a lot of trouble reading his serve. Um, couldn't get into many return games and put some pressure on him. Um, so that was very difficult. And uh, But, um, yeah, that's kudos to him, just too good serving. And in the match, it seemed like he was able to take command of some, uh, you know, most of the points like uh, uh, more uh, earlier than, than you could. And, you know, do you think there's anything in retrospect that you could have maybe done differently as well for that? Yeah, I mean, like I said, I, I need to come out with a little bit more intensity right right from the get-go. Um, and then on the return, maybe give him a couple different looks, uh, try to find a way to get in the return game somehow because, uh, yeah, he, he was he was holding sometimes um, in less than a minute, so it's really tough. Right, and, you know, despite the, you know, the, this match, it obviously is amazing to get to your first uh, ATP main draw. And can you talk about the support that you received in, you know, uh, in the area? Yeah, I mean, uh, all three matches I played here I had a uh, great crowd, awesome atmosphere to play in, a lot of uh, go-hoos from the stands, and um, so that's awesome uh, to have that support. I mean, I, the four years of college tennis is my best time in my life, so to uh, kind of make that happen again is uh, really special. I appreciate that, Ty. And one last question. For all the amateurs out there, could you just give us one key tip for them to help them uh, improve their tennis games? Yeah, I mean, uh, I think the biggest thing is to um, maybe uh, in practice always try to have the same intensity that you have in a match. Um, you know, you don't have to. I'm not a big proponent of spending four to six hours on the court. I think it, if you spend two really high quality hours of good intensity, a lot of focus, you know, no chit chat or, and things like that, then it's uh, better than maybe four hours of kind of dilly dallying on the court. Great. Thanks, Ty. All the best uh, moving forward. Thanks. Thanks. Appreciate it. Thanks.